What's going on, little dap? It's Jared Munz, former pro and founder of OnlineSoccerAcademy.com. Today, we are learning how to build team chemistry. Team chemistry is important because it helps you know your teammates better on the field, and ultimately, it helps you win games. Plus, playing on a team that is cool with each other is much better than playing on one with a bunch of jerks. On a side note, did you know about the OnlineSoccerAcademy.com search bar? Next time you think to comment or ask me how to shoot with the outside of your foot, go to OnlineSoccerAcademy.com and type outside or shoot in the search bar and BAM! There's your answer. I'm happy to help, but the search bar can get your answer much faster. Team chemistry ideas. Most team chemistry is built off the field, not on it. Here are a few ideas for you and your team. Make sure you share this OSA video with your coach. Idea number one, hug your teammates. What's up, little dad, what's happening? What? Hug each other? Yes, hug each other when you get to practice, or at least little dap or something. There's a hormone in your body called oxytocin that gets released and shared between you and your teammate in a weird kinda chemical hormonal way when you make physical contact. They say this hormone helps incorporate trust with your teammates and aggressive behavior towards outsiders. Example being other teams you beat 3-0. They would be outsiders. I was at a speech once and the person giving it was saying that the common thread amongst championship teams was high levels of oxytocin. These players were always hugging and high-fiving each other and even the occasional slap on the butt. Nice job. Ever notice when you watch YouTube videos of Barcelona practicing, in their warm-ups, they're always hugging each other. That Barca team is kind of good. Call me crazy, but everyone likes a hug. Bonus tip, after hugging, ask your teammate how their day was. How is school going? Get to know them. Be social. Idea number two, have a team barbecue or movie night. A team that hangs out together competes together. Ask your parents to organize a team barbecue, pizza party, or movie night. Have everyone over. Create a FIFA PlayStation tournament, or just chill out. But I'd suggest doing something at your party to get people talking and to be social. I'm no party planner, just saying. My team captain at the Chicago Fire was Chris Armas, and he does barbecues at his house. Good times, good bonding. Bonus tip, be a good guest and bring something to the party, like cookies or dip, and make sure you stay afterwards and clean up. Idea number three, volunteer at a charity. If there's a local food bank or Habitat for Humanity in your town, get your team together and volunteer a few hours of your time to help. The best pros give back to their communities. Idea number four, play fun games at the end of practice. Stick around one night after training and organize a soccer tennis tournament or soccer golf, like 20 or 30 minutes. Get your teammates laughing and cutting loose out there. Idea number five, play practical jokes. Occasionally, play practical jokes on each other. I'm not talking picking on each other or hurting each other's feelings, but lighthearted fun jokes. Here are two suggestions. Get two of your teammates in on it. Billy, does this smell funny to you? Sarah, does this seem odd to you? Tim, does this smell funny to you? Tim puts his nose towards the cupcake, and as he's smelling it, BAM! Don't hurt poor Timmy, but a little pop so the frosting gets on there. Bonus tip, don't eat it afterwards. Your team has all their bags lined up looking all professional. While you are tying your shoe, you drop down and unstrap Timmy's bag strap and fold it on the bag so it looks like normal. Then, when all your teammates are grabbing their bags, you can have a good laugh when Timmy grabs his. Good session, good session boys! <laughs> Those are just a few ideas on how to create team chemistry. Soccer slash football is fun, so enjoy it. Know when to have a good time and when to be serious and focused. The best pros are usually the ones laughing the most in the locker room and living life with a smile on their face. Hope you enjoyed this online soccer academy training video. Like, favorite, and share this video if you did. And don't forget to subscribe on YouTube or sign up and create your profile for free at OnlineSoccerAcademy.com. Players all over the world use it, and you can do game reviews and track your progress. Post a comment and let me know if this video worked for you. My name is Jared Munts, and remember, if you believe in it and back that up with hard work, anything in life is possible. Believe in it! Key point! 
Number one, say, believe in it. Tell yourself, in your mind, multiple times a day, I believe in it. Anytime you have a negative thought, say, believe in it, and block it.